Welcome to Crotoni Entertainment. I'm Chris. And I'm Bree. And I'm covered in ants. No, no, he's today. Not. We're today we're gonna paint bones. This is gonna be uh, a bare bones paint job. To, ah. to part of I feel like I'm covered in ants. Have you ever felt like you have ants crawling on you, but you don't? You check, and there's no ants. Yes. I, because I got bit some by some mosquitoes coming back in from dinner. I feel like I have ants on my legs now, and it's bothering me. But I don't have any ants on my legs. I've checked multiple times. Anyway. <laughs> So, Chris may or may not be having an issue. Ooh, you're painting already. I'm, Never painting, mind. I'm painting Bones. We're, we're right into it. This is a short video because Bones was easy. After last week's challenge of the five-color Bulk and Skull challenge, which turned into an absolute paint-wasting nightmare, yes, it did. Uh, I went back to the basics on Bones. This is a simple paint job. It's a palette cleansing paint job. We did the video about cleaning your palette. This is how you clean your mental painting palette. You take a miniature that's going to be super easy, but still be super striking by the time you're gone, done, and you just get it done. So we primed them with our Krylon 2X uh, Matte Perfect Gray, as per always, yep. and we washed the entire model with Agrax Shade. I love that color any, so much. Any brown wash will do. I love it so much. Any brown wash will do, but we did this one with all Agrax Shade. Then we're going into our contrast paints, Skeleton Horde. Mm, to give him that little bit of a uh, daddy look. Correct. Now, my skeleton horde is going to be darker than most people's skeleton horde. Um, the pot is getting old already. Mm. Um, the it's, it's, does it have that weird funk? Well, as, the, as the contrast paints get lower, they uh, get some concentrated. Of that, some of the medium kind of dissolves. Mm -hmm. so I could put more medium in it and kind of revive it. Um, I can't do that with my Gillum and Flesh. There was an incident with it the other day. I need a new pot. Uh, but we don't need Gilman Flesh here. We need Skeleton Horde. And I did not go ahead and um, bring it back to life with my medium before doing this. So you'll notice that my Skeleton Horde has a lot of additional uh, yellow in it. Mm -hmm. But that's okay, because this, this is not our final form, so to speak. Okay. Okay. What you going to do? I'm going to paint him. I'm going to paint the model. That's what we do in the show. Paint the model. I, I, um, I'm beginning to question the sanity of the people who watch the show. Uh, there was somebody who said, we have the premiere Heroes of the Grid content you, on the Twitter you today. You showed me that comment, and I, I want to know who hurt you. I don't know. It's okay. Uh, so the next step is to take a nice, big, flat-bladed brush. Yeah. Uh, something you can dry brush with. Ooh, and, it. and a bone color, a cream of some kind. I went with Vallejo Game Color Elfin Flesh. I love Elfin Flesh. Uh, I've never used it before. We, oh, bought, we bought it, and it just sits there. So what I did is I, I put a glob of that flesh on here, mm -hmm. and I wiped almost all of it off on a paper towel. And you can just see I'm just running the brush over bones, and all that lower level that the skeleton horde is shaded is staying nice and dark, and everything above it is picking up this color. And it's doing all the work for me. I'm not wasting my time with line highlighting. Uh, You're not wasting your time mixing all of the paint and then exactly. you know, not liking is, the color? This is the lazy tech that apparently gives us the seal of approval from... Some guy on Twitter, I actually know whose username it is. I don't want to say it out loud in case he doesn't actually want me to. Uh, but some guy on Twitter says, we have the premier Power Rangers Here's the Grid content, which just says there's a wide open space on YouTube for anybody to come and make content because <laughs> this, this, is, uh, this is hot garbage. <laughs> I mean, so anyway, unless you like dumpster fires, in which case, welcome. Citadel so, so Black Templar. I had these great ambitions when I picked up Bones. I said, man, I can take such a simple model. I can do some really cool highlights. You know, I've really never cool. noticed before that he's not actually like bones, that he has pants. He doesn't have pants. But like, that's not okay. Um, no one said he's a human skeleton. <laughs> that is that is you being. I'm a humanist. Look at me yeah, being that's all being like you species. A, a species centric uh, uh, yeah. individual. This is clearly a space pilgrim magician. <laughs> Ah, yes. Because he's got that sick pilgrim hat. He does have that sick I'm not, pilgrim I'm hat. I'm not sure what's going on with that. I don't remember. I don't think Bones was a Thanksgiving episode. Thing. No, he wasn't. I almost made Bones a Thanksgiving miniature instead of a Halloween theme miniature because of that pilgrim hat. But, I mean, it is. But I have a whole Thanksgiving theme planned out. If we don't get our Kickstarter in time, I have a whole Thanksgiving theme planned out. I ran over it with you the other day. I don't yep. want to share it out loud. No, yet. no, no. It's a good idea. I so, like I had it. These, so I had these high ambitions for Bones. I said, I just came off the high of the Vulcan Skull Challenge. Uh, I can go ahead and do something really cool with the highlights on this. Let me do nice layered black and nice layered red. And then I started painting him. And, and I he was just no. like, no. I said, no. This model, I, honestly, it's kind of ugly. This is not the best sculpt oh, they've ever done. Oh, it's an ugly model? It's not the best sculpt they've done for this game. It, it actually looks kind of goofy. I'm, uh, now that, wait, 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 uh, wait. Now, okay, all Power Rangers monsters look kind of goofy. And, any, and, be like, and mm. Tommy Oliver just looks like a two-legged cat you'd leave on the side of the road. Christopher! You're right. You're right. I wouldn't leave a two-legged cat on the side of the road. I would leave Tommy Oliver <laughs> on the side of the road, though. <laughs> <laughs> but this this model, if you compare it to uh, several of the other sculpts, it, it doesn't look 
great. It's it's out of place. I don't know what happened here. Um, I think it and honestly, if you go back, the sculptor and you, had some gamer juice. The sculptor had some game. I mean, I, it could just it could just be this particular monster. Maybe there was no way to make him look good. Because I think that he may looks, have because he it. looks terrible in all the reference photos too. Yeah, he was one of those 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 uh, costumes that when it got here from Japan it had clearly sat in. I don't think a they. Container. I don't think they used his costume in the American show. I think his footage was purely Japanese. In which case, um, Japan does not know what human human skeleton looks like. But but anyway, after the um, after the the fiasco that was uh, me wasting a five gallon bucket worth of paint on Bones and Skull. <laughs> Yeah, I yeah, said I said screw it. Let's do bones as Super easy as easy. we can. Yep, and oh, it was so satisfying. Just to be like, and poop done. Because he still came out good looking. So it's mostly contrast paints with some dry brushing of non contrast paints. So he's we, just a good looking. So we got the flesh terrors red, and even at this point, even now, I was still thinking I can I can ramp this up. I was thinking I'm going to do some nice highlights on this cape. At what time of the morning nice, were you doing this painting? Do some, I don't know, five o'clock. Uh, <laughs> so, do okay. some nice, do some nice upper highlights on. Oh, oh, oh there's that me. yawn there's, button. There's, there's a yawn. Oh, hey, we have a yawn button at Cretonia Entertainment. We don't press it. No. Nope. If we have it, I don't know where it is. It's um, so I was even thinking here, I could do some nice highlights on this red. Maybe the highest tip being like it. And then, and then, and then it Does happen. he have a bow tie on? Yeah, he's very, he's very dapper. I did not realize he had a bow tie he's on. Very, he's a very dapper gentleman. He is a very, very dapper skeleton. This is actually the alt punk look of his particular planet. Okay, I'm pure for we, it. We talked about this not being a human skeleton. This is a. Um, he's some kind of alien. Yeah, well, I mean, he's clearly on a pilgrimage to Earth. He's looking for uh, bones of rock. Bones of rock, so he can meet. Oh, this is going to come out really bad. This is I shouldn't I shouldn't do this. You're gonna do something you know horrible. What? You know what? This is our Thanksgiving themed episode for Canada. Wow. Because Canadian Thanksgiving is wrong. I mean in October. <laughs> <laughs> just lost just lost just lost all, all the Canadians. All, 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 all our Canadian viewers. Yep. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna funny, say here's a I'm funny story about Canadians. somebody. Cause his the handle is DJ D, there's no DJ. DK. DK. Yeah. DK, I'm sorry. You know what I'm talking about? I'm sorry. He's already banned from the channel. He's not banned from the channel. No, he put a comment that I should ban him from the channel, so I banned him from the channel. Oh, that's not nice. <laughs> that's not nice. We both know I didn't ban him from the channel. <laughs> so, he's in Newfoundland, I believe. Yes. Um, that's Canada. We apologize. Uh, but happy Thanksgiving. Your Thanksgiving is wrong unless you're going to send us sides. <laughs> We'll take a care package of Canadian Thanksgiving sides. It's 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 I Tim ass- Hortons hot dog. Yeah, I assume it's, it's a Tim, Tim Hortons donut and some kind of smoked salmon. <laughs> I, wow, we're so oh sorry. <laughs> I'm not even drinking yet. No, we're so sorry. So we here's had a funny story. Sto- here's a funny story about Canada. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to move on to our Iron Breaker. I said yeah. uh, Iron Breaker. Uh, this is for the belt buckle, that nice pilgrim belt buckle, and his sword. He does have a big. Is he's not wearing pants. To be a- Pilgrim? He, he's not wearing pants, and he has an amazing belt. I respect this power move. <laughs> I, you know, I, it's I love... Sca- it's I, clearly you know, his scabbard you know, for his sword. Years ago, when there was that big trend of um, uh, women wearing uh, belts over their over their tops, I was a big fan of that trend. Yes, I you don't know. still hold uh, out for it it's every a good, now and it's, then. A good, it's a good trend. Uh, it works on bones, too. <laughs> it works on most. Okay, so Canadians, Look, let's yeah. let's just double down on making know, all of Canada. I don't hate want us. to make Canada hate us. I, I have like Canada. I have heard every stereotype about Canada that you have, but I have never in actual person because we met we met Kyle on the phone and oh the I guess the Discord phone, and he's a real nice guy. Yeah, I've never met a Canadian in person who wasn't a jerk. I don't know why. Anyway, apothecary white on this feather. I did it right over all these beiges because I, I wanted a dirty white. I didn't want it super clean. Because I figured this guy's some kind of space skeleton pilgrim. He's probably got space scurvy. Space scurvy? Yeah, that's probably a thing. I. So if you're from Canada, we apologize. And you're going to be in our neck of the woods. And I you're apologize. You're not a jerk. I'd love to meet you. But I have been in a number of industries. When I was in high school, I was in grocery. When I was out of college, I was in. Uh, Education, didn't meet any Canadians in education. Uh, then I was in automotive and now I'm in construction. I have uh, supervised the repairs of cars for Canadian um, customers. I have built homes for Canadians. And 
Everyone I've ever dealt with has been a jerk. Because Canada I kicked them out. I, well, Ooh, they're I mean, here. Well, Canada's huge, too. So yeah. I assume there's like pockets of jerks where maybe the Tim Hortons is not as fresh. <laughs> <laughs> I want to try Tim Hortons one day. I really do. Anytime you want to really go do. to Canada, we'll go. I am um, all for it. I love Canada. It's a so next country. episode will be live from Canada. No, it Bree won't. said anytime I want to go to Canada. So we're pointing you to can't go to Canada right now. I mean, I can go Canada adjacent. You want to go to Buffalo? I mean, the, the, no. the wing, the hot sauce. I, they do. So we no oil on this. This got really bad. <laughs> so no oil on the sword and the belt buckle. Canada, I'm like 70% sorry and 30% kind of get over it. I'm joking. Yeah. We um, love, I, I love Canada. I'm got, here for Canada. Let's finish this lunatic off. We're already Yay. done. We're already done. We're already done. Look at this. Just a couple contrast paints. One dry I, brush. You know, I'm going to criticize you real quick. I love you, but I'm going to criticize you. Yeah, you're out of the family. I, Amber orange around the base. Go ahead and criticize me. You run out of time. I would have done a, one more highlight on the bone. Oh, well, you know what? When we compare all the Power Rangers models I painted to all the ones you painted, we can have a conversation. <laughs> you won't with let them. me. Damn right you I won't let you. I want let consistency. Me. Our styles are totally different. <laughs> Our styles are totally different. Yeah, and I'm we... not allowing this to happen. <laughs> and this is why I'm. Somebody concerned. send us another copy of the core game so Brie can paint it. We'll have a painted competition. Uh, It'd be amazing. I, I'm okay it's, with it's not fair. She's watched all my videos except the ones she didn't watch. Except that's what all right. Bones is done. We're tired of bones now. It looks it's, good. It looks good. It looks I like good. Him. Some contrast, some basic dry brushing. It's a very simple model. It it's looks very good. simple. One more highlight, though. One, one more highlight. You in the face. <laughs> you, gonna, you gonna put this guy on the Instagram? Yep. Yep. He will be up there tomorrow. All right. Happy first monster of Halloween after our Bulk and Skull Halloween kickoff episode. Happy Canadian Thanksgiving. You don't and even we'll know be, what that is. I have no idea. Oh my God. We'll, it's in October. Ugh. We'll be back next week with uh, the next Halloween theme mini. Like and subscribe for more content. Hit that bell button for notification. And forgive me, Canada. Bye. I'm sorry, Canada. Sorry, boot that.